Hello everyone. Today's question is, how does the Quran depict the story of Jesus' birth? Ah, Christmas time. This is the season for homemade cookies, decked out Christmas trees and presents. But what most of us forget all too often is why Christmas is celebrated. Christmas is the annual Christian celebration of the birth of Jesus Christ. Jesus, or Prophet Isa as he is known in the Quran, is one of the most important prophets of Islam. In Islam, Jesus is a prophet and not under any circumstances the Son of God. He is revered in Islam but not worshipped as he is in Christianity. But in Islam, not only Jesus but also Mary is very important to the story. In the Holy Quran, Mary is described as being one of the special women on earth. In fact, she was chosen twice. Once, she was chosen as being the glad tiding which was bestowed on Hannah and Imran. And secondly, she was chosen because she became pregnant without a man. This is why Prophet Jesus is believed in Islam not to have a father, similar to Prophet Adam and Eve, who were also created without a father or mother. In the Quran, it is explained that Mary had gone to the temple to pray when an angel appeared in the form of a man, telling her that God had sent him to tell her that she was going to be pregnant and have a son. Mary became worried and wondered aloud how she was to conceive a child when she had been chaste and was a virgin. The angel explained that if God decreed something, he only had to say be and it was and that the fact that she was going to conceive a son without a father and while being a virgin was going to be a miracle on mankind. So it was that Mary became pregnant and withdrew from society to a remote place. There she also delivered her son by a palm tree on her own. When she was grievous about meeting others, the voice told her to indicate that she was holding a fast of silence and to indicate to her newborn, who miraculously was able to speak and tell the people that he indeed was the son of a virgin mother and that he was the Messiah that was sent down to the people. Prophet Jesus' conception, birth and life were full of miracles and wonders this is why he is also revered in the Islamic faith. What's your question? Don't forget to send us, and remember, your question is our question too.